So here goes the water detecting circuit. Uh, here by there we you have a tank of water and I want a notification when it's full. So you can set an alarm. Uh, in our case here we did not have a well working buzzer at the moment. We are limited with resources. And at least an LED which will take the place of uh, which would also represent the buzzer. And so basically when the water is not full, the LED is off. As you can see in our, our cup here in the tank is a tank of water. And so now let us the water is not full. So we have the contact wires, these two, and so they are put above your tank. They are hanging here at the top until and when the water reaches automatically due to the when the water comes to contact with the two uh, with the two contact wires voila uh, the, the, the circuit is complete and you can see your alarm or whatever you've placed on the intake maybe you could even not use an led and have a uh, maybe instead of an led you might have an octocoupler to control another circuit which could maybe switch off the the water from the mains or such kind of scenarios and remember we have not even intended to we have not even done any programming this is just engineering part electrical part of it to in order to reduce the expenses and also to make this technology cheaper cheaper because we don't we want to purchase such kind of a technology which include timers and programming it's so expensive and we are making it cheaper by just doing the electrical part of it and so you can see it's cheap so when your water is full uh, when the water touches just the contact wires you can see that an alarm is rung and you can know that uh, your tank is full of water and do the necessary or you can have a mechanism where the water is switched off uh, at the means this is such a good experiment and uh, we intend to redo it again because actually we intended to have an alarm whereby when the water is full you can hear an alarm uh, ringing is a in our case we would use a buzzer and uh, that is the main idea of all these things you can see here. It's quite an interesting uh, project, and this is the first project for water detecting. It's the year 2021. Thank you very much.